Hi everyone, my name's Mark and I'm one of the PGA teaching professionals here at the Royal Golf Club. Today we're on the 17th bunker and I'm basically going to give you a few things that you can change in your setup and a little bit in your swing in order to produce a good shot. Now a lot of the members know that we have a lot of bunkers here on the championship course so it's very important that we know how to get out of the bunker. Now the first thing I'd like you to do is have a look at your setup. So we're wanting to produce a very much upward strike into the shot. We don't want to produce that very steep angle because when we produce that very steep angle we catch it very heavy and the ball's not necessarily going to have a lot of distance on the shot so what I want you to do is really get that feeling of creating a much more upward strike into the ball so first of all what I'd like you to do is move the ball position slightly further forward and then in your shoulder alignment what I want you to do is really drop the right shoulder again what that's going to do is influence a very much upward strike now your shoulder alignment determines your path but it also determines your angle of attack into the ball. So by dropping the right shoulder, like I say, that's gonna help us influence a much shallower angle into the ball. Now, in the downswing, what I really want you to get the feeling of doing is keeping your weight onto that right hand side. I don't want you to really shift your weight over to your left, again, and swaying over to that left hand side, because that's gonna produce, again, much more steeper angle into the ball. So we've got a few things there that we can change. And like I say, we really want to get that feeling of clipping the ball and if anything, thinning the ball, because again, we're going to get that distance, but we again, all it is, is we want to produce a lot of loft on the club face. So I'll try this shot for you now. So really over exaggerating the ball position, getting that weight over to the right, dropping the shoulder alignment and being confident in the swing. What we don't want to do is slow down, really accelerate through 